Hey guys, so welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be how I wash and clean my brushes. That's the same thing. How I wash and dry my brushes. Hopefully you guys are doing great. I feel like I feel like whenever I start my intro with like, hey guys, what's up? This is what I'm doing. Like I feel like it's not like personal enough. I want to be like, hey guys, how are you? How's your day? How's your little money going? You know? This video shouldn't be too long and too hard. Yeah, so if you guys want to see how I wash and dry my brushes, keep watching. If you guys don't like this kind of video, do not fucking watch it. You know the drill. I have an ombre lip going. You know she's feeling herself today. So just do not even watch the video. But if you guys do, if you guys want to see how I clean and dry my eye brushes, like a little quick how-to, then keep watching. You know, my process is pretty simple. You know, it's a pretty easy thing. So this this method is like how I do my eye brushes. So when I'm not doing like a, a huge variety, like a huge amount of brushes, this is what I do. I, If you guys are anything like me, you probably only clean like five brushes at a time. I have so many brushes, like I don't know if you can even tell. The entire thing is all brushes. So I have so many brushes and I do not like to clean all of them at one time. Like I just, it's just not my thing. I like to do like five to ten at a time. That's just what I like to do. Um, I'm not like one of those big like, let me just do like, <laughs> wash 300. So this is like the method I do for my eye ones. So what we're going to be using, the, my featured cute little product on the thing, is going to be the Bomb Beauty Cleaning Egg Things. Stop these little like brush like cleaners. Ooh, I have two. I think my mom stole my other one because I can't find my hot pink one. There's another one, there's like a hot ass pink one, and I think she stuck it because I cannot find it in my room anywhere. <laughs> um, so yeah, these were sent to me by Bomb Beauty. So thank you guys so much at Bomb Beauty for sending them to me. I really love them. The reason I love them is one because they're so adorable, and like I'm a, I'm a bitch when it comes to gimmicky things. Like if it's cute and the packaging is adorable and it's like small and tiny, like I'm it needs to meet mine. Like I don't know if like, like if you guys are like that, but that's how I am, especially shit that works. Like I'm like. Give it to me right now. I'm gonna go do a little demo and I'm gonna leave it right here in this section so my little face is gonna move over to the side. So this is what, this is just what I like to do. I like to use the Beauty Blender Solid Cleanser to do it with and I've already hit pan on this one. I don't know if you can even tell. Okay, so this is what I like to do. I like to rub my brush underwater first, dip it into the Beauty Blender Solid Cleanser, just a little like quick one-two, like little swirl, and then I'll kind of grab my little egg, put my fingers through it, and then I'll just kind of do like a one-two swipe, a little swirl in the divots of it, because the divots are actually pretty deep, so you really are cleaning a lot of the brush. So that's kind of what I do with like more of the fluffy brushes. If I'm using a small, more dense brush, like more of an eye detail brush, I like to use the little like grooves that are at the top of the little egg thingy, and I'll just kind of run that in there. It's a dense silicone like material, so it really does clean when you're running it through it like a groove like this the solid cleanser is really great at picking up any dirt and grime that you might have in the brush it's an antibacterial so it really cleans deep so I think the combination of the beauty blender solid cleanser and a nice deep cleaning silicone type material I feel like it just gets deeper into the ferrule into the bristles like this is the janky part this is how I dry it okay this is like the kind of janky jank so what I do is I'll grab toilet paper cut it in half like you're basically like peel like the ply into two Put my little brush in the middle of it and I'll just like kind of wrap it because not only will it dry the brushes, it'll keep the form of the bristles. Instead of having to go out and buy like those little nets for the brushes, why don't you just use like some toilet paper? It's going to dry it and it's going to keep the form really well as long as you're like tying it pretty tightly. So I actually have like the ones I used in the video. So they're right here. I let them dry overnight because I filmed that last night, like the little demo part. So this is what they end up looking like when you take them off. Complete form. Like, look at my Morphe F433 and my Sigma E40. Like, the form is completely complete, and they're dry. I just think this is a really <laughs> simple, easy, free way to dry your brushes, you know? Um, I'm all about the cost-efficient kind of style of things, so I like the fact that the brush cleaner like itself is like 10 bucks, and the solid cleanser is like also, I think, 10 bucks. I'm not actually sure how much this is. I've gotten two of them. I just literally just throw it in my basket and like, pay. Buy that shit. Obviously, toilet paper is free if you if your parents buy it for you. But yeah, you know, I think it's just an easy way. If you guys are anything like me and you like to just clean a couple brushes at a time, which I do <laughs> so often, then you guys will like it. I know you guys will like it for sure. You know, and the same concept applies for if you're washing your face brushes. I'm just like a fan of using silicone cleaners because it's just easier. It's honestly it's just easier for me. It's faster for me. This just does all the work for me instead of using it on my fingers. When I used to work at Sephora, I had to clean the brushes at the end of the night. I swear to you if we just had some type of silicone cleaner or like the Sigma matte or like one of the Mom Beauty like it would have been so much easier than having to run it through our hands all the time it was such a pain in the ass dude it was a pain in the ass oh also with the Bomb Beauty um they did actually send me a code to use if you guys did want to buy one of them um, I'm sure a lot of people have not heard of Bomb Beauty before these little like these little eggs I think it's really cool 
and the back, the little divots on the back, you can use like it to clean like a beauty blender to like squeeze out like the dirt from it because it has these little grooves on the back. I just think they thought of everything with this cute little thing. I do actually have a little 15% um, off code with them. It's Manny MUA. If you guys type it into their site, you get 15% off. Or if you buy more than one, I think it's like you get 30% off. That's pretty cool. Pretty cool. It is a commission code, so I do make a small amount. I like to tell you guys those things, kind of things. So if you guys are interested in buying one, um, you just say 15% off, and I do get a small commission of it. But of course, if you guys are not interested in using a commission code or anything like that, I totally understand. They're the ones that offered me to do a little commission thing, and I was like, you know what? Why not? Save the money for my subs and followers, and I get a little a little small commission. So I figured, you know what? Let's just do that. And you know, I think the product's cute, and I think it's totally worth it. I really, 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 really do. I think my favorite one is the hot pink one. I wish I could show you guys because I don't have it. But I also like the black one because it has a glitter in it, too. I think they're so cute. And they're 10 bucks. Like, really? The Sigma Matte is like 25 to 30. Like, other ones are much more expensive. So I think this is just really... It's cool. Of all the cleaners, like, cleansers I have, it's probably, like, the one that I have that's the fastest and most efficient for just doing a quick, like, eye brush. You know what I mean? Bomb Beauty Little Eggs. The little eggs on the bomb mute. And the toilet paper. Check out the toilet paper, too, if you guys are interested in that shit. But yeah, that was it for the video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. It's a very just quick, easy how I clean and dry my brushes, or at least my eye ones. I, I can always do a video on how I do like my face ones, or like if I'm doing a big, huge amount at one time, what I like to use for that. This is just what I like to use for eye brushes and quick, like quick on the go things. They dry fast, they clean fast. It's just easy. It's so easy this way for me. So if you guys enjoyed this kind of video, give it a thumbs up and like and subscribe and comment and let you guys know. Shane, you guys know I like where you guys are coming and stuff like that. But yeah, other than that, I will talk to you guys later. Have a great rest of the night or day wherever you guys are and I will catch you in my next video. Bye guys. <laughs> Just ignore the mess. Ignore that. This is my normal angle. I feel like I look different. What the fuck? What I look different for? Hey guys, so welcome back to my channel. My little face. No, uh. <laughs> it's not gonna be too hard, it's not gonna be too long. But you know what we, that's what we prefer. How do I hold this for a fucking photo? Is it in focus though? Yeah. This little, um, plastic product I guess you would I don't even know this video is actually gonna be pretty same thing applies if you're doing if you're using mm -hmm.